all this? Robespierre. He's declared today a festival of the supreme being. A peer into the virtue of the nation and the citizen's duty toward it. Why does that sound familiar? As far as Templar doctrine goes, it's a loose interpretation. We'll never get close to him in the middle of all this. We best retire and wait for a better opportunity. He's still thinking like an assassin. This time, I have that. Oh? And what would that be? Think like a Templar. Robespierre is unassailable. He's got half the guard out in force. We'll never get within ten yards of him. Just what I said. But he's not as popular as he was. The purges, the supreme being cult. If we can discredit him, he's finished. A massive public spectacle is the perfect venue. Exactly. Paint him as a dangerous lunatic and his power will evaporate like snow in April. But we'll need some convincing evidence. I have an idea where to start. You coming? Meet me after. I have my own arrangements to make. Robespierre, take care that you do not allow your personal ambitions to come before the great work. That which we do, we do not for our own glory, but to remake the world into Malay's image. Germain. Interesting, but not particularly helpful. Looks like a diary. At exactly five in the morning, a general recall shall be sounded in Paris. This call shall invite every citizen, men and women alike, to immediately adorn their houses with the beloved colors of liberty, either by rehanging their flags or by embellishing their houses with garlands of flowers and greenery. Hardly the sort of thing to topple a tyrant with. Publicist de la Révolution Française. The day after Marat died. Hardly the sort of thing to topple a tyrant with. Monsieur, as you have been the savior of the Republic, I beg you now to be my brother's savior as well. 
Even now he languishes in prison, arrested by patriots more zealous in their heroism than careful in their methods. No warrant for André's arrest was ever issued, and yet he remains imprisoned in Saint-Lazare under suspicion. I pray you do not recall my brother's writings in the Journal de Paris, coming as they did from an intemperate poet's heart. Rather, I beg you, if my own humble skills have been even the smallest of aid to our glorious revolution, spare my brother. In his writings, I see the burgeoning of France's greatest poet, a light that will shine for all time. Yours in patriotism, Marie-Joseph Chenier. Hardly the sort of thing to topple a tyrant with. Merlin, Talien, Bourdon. These are all deputies of the National Convention. Lists of political figures written in the hand of a man fond of sending his rivals to the guillotine. Yes, you should do nicely. Fifty or so deputies of the National Convention, all written in Robespierre's hand and all opposed to him. I imagine those good gentlemen would be quite interested to know they're on that list. But first... Monsieur Robespierre brought his own refreshments. Distract the guards, I have an idea. Distract the guards? Right. and the poisons of atheism. Oh, 
powdered agate. Causes hallucinations. This will make him look mad. Now we have to make him look dangerous. The list of names. It must fall into the right hands, anonymously. If our involvement gets out, it'll tip Germain off. Leave that part to me. want to drive from the Republic. To wisdom alone does it belong to consolidate the prosperity of empire. Being a list of enemies of the revolution. Half a hundred names here. Robespierre's well, gone too far this time. That set the fox in the hen house. Pity the hens. Now what? We wait. It won't take long. Once Robespierre has lost the support of the people, he'll be no more use to Germain. But when Germain abandons him... He's vulnerable. Let's go. Thank you. 
amusant. We may have gone too far in discrediting Robespierre. What's happened? He's been arrested. What? Apparently, he made vague threats about a purge against enemies of the state, and the committee turned on him. They're taking him to Luxembourg. He's scheduled for execution in the morning. Then we'd best get to him first. just yet. We might be able to find some sign of what happened. We have to find him. from the Paris Commune attacked us en route. They were trying to free the prisoners. Did they take Robespierre? I'm not sure. The fighting left me behind. They fell back that way. Merci. Go find yourself a doctor. Oh. He's still in custody. They'll have taken him to Luxembourg prison. But if not, they'll need to hole up somewhere nearby. They won't get very far with half the city turned out against Robespierre. I'll check the prison. You follow the riot, see if you can pick up a trail. Right. Where is Robespierre? They took him that way. Right there. Right there. Tyrant! Wilson! Wilson! 
some reinforcements arrive. You see ya? Get in! God, you made it, sir. The commune stands with you. Thank you, Sergeant. Your loyalty does you credit. Let's get inside, sir. The convention soldiers will be here soon. Yes, of course. I place myself in your capable hands. By dint of its actions, protecting the criminal Robespierre is now an open rebellion against the nation. Soldiers under the king, the criminal of Robespierre, is now an open rebellion against the nation. Soldiers under the command of the National Convention have been dispatched to apprehend the traitor Robespierre and his followers. Citizens are advised to remain in their homes while justice is carried out. Be it further known that citizen Robespierre, citizen Oriol, and all... Oh, this place if the convention attacks.
First sign of convention troops, I'm out of here. Shh. Someone will hear. Thank <laughs> you. 
Five more were missing at last muster. At this rate, convention won't have to fight. <laughs> sent for Zemma hours ago. Zemma warned me about you. You're one of them, aren't you? An assassin. Not anymore. Where's Germain? Elise. We don't have much time. Where is Germain? I will never talk. Ah! Then right. Ah! 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 The temple. We should have known. I hope you enjoy revolutionary justice, monsieur. Seize him!
We should split up. I'm not sure that's... Less chance we both get caught that way. I suppose that's true. We'll rendezvous inside. If you get a shot at Jelma, you take it. Germain's built himself quite a fortress. I can't see any weak spots.
What the hell was that? So the prodigal assassin returns. I suspected as much when Latouche stopped sending his tax revenues. You've become quite the thorn in my side. I assume Robespierre was your... The direct approach from an assassin. How refreshing. I assume Robespierre was your doing as well. Laughable! No matter. No, oh, please. You'll have to do better than that. The metal has been fired and shaped. Quenching it will only set its form. How? What? And he... Smarter than that. Don't oh, please, you'll have to do 
abandoned our purpose. I will fight. Caught in their very lie, we crafted to shepherd them. Caught in their very lie, we crafted to shepherd them. Caught in their very lie, we crafted to shepherd the masses. I'll kill you. You cannot hide from me, boy. Almost free. I can take him. No, you can't. Not alone. Wait for me. I'm sorry. Elise! Bravo, you've slain the villain. That is how you cast this little morality play in your mind, isn't it? Oh, I'm not really here. I'm not really there either. At the moment, I'm bleeding out in the floor of the temple. But it seems the father of understanding has seen fit to give us this time to talk. Ah, a particular favorite of mine. I did not understand the visions that haunted my mind, you see. Great towers of gold, cities, shining white as silver. I thought I was going mad. And I found this place. Dr. Molay's vault. Through his writings, I understood. 
Understood what? Somehow, through the centuries, I was connected to Grand Master de Molay. And had I been chosen to purge the order of decadence and corruption that had set in like rot, and to wash the world clean and restore to the truth the Father of Understanding intended. That seems to have gone over well. Prophets are seldom appreciated in their own time. Exile and abasement forced me to reevaluate my strategy, find new avenues for the realization of my purpose. No matter the cost. A new order never comes without destruction of the old. And if men are made to fear untrammeled liberty, so much the better. A brief taste of chaos will remind them why they crave obedience. Here's we part ways here. Think on this. The march of progress is slow, but it is inevitable as a glacier. All you've accomplished is to delay the inevitable. One death cannot stop the tide. Perhaps it'll not be my hand that shepherds mankind back to its proper place. But it will be someone's. Think on this when you remember her. The creed of the Assassin Brotherhood teaches us that nothing is forbidden to us. Once, I thought that meant we were free to do as we would, to pursue our ideals no matter the cost. I understand now. Not a grant of permission, the creed is a warning. Ideals too easily give way to dogma. Dogma becomes fanaticism. No higher power sits in judgment of us. No supreme being watches to punish us for our sins. In the end, only we ourselves can guard against our obsessions. Only we can decide whether the road we walk carries too high a toll. We believe ourselves redeemers, avengers, saviors. We make war on those who oppose us, and they in turn make war on us. We dream of leaving our stamp upon the world. Even as we give our lives in a conflict that will be recorded in no history book. All that we do, all that we are, begins and ends with ourselves.
Lucy. I won this fight two centuries before it started. Well done, kid. Uh, I don't think Abstergo will bother searching the catacombs for Jermaine's body. The bones are going to be too damaged, too decayed. We're in the clear with this sage. You did good work, Initiate. Until we contact you again, the best you can do is continue searching Arnold's memories for anything else he might have seen, like rare historical data, more DNA samples, anything to help our cause. We'll be in touch when we need you. Count on it.